Hi YouTube, this is your girl here, Dollface CC17, and I'm coming by today to do a hair review on this hair that I have installed in right now. Um, so let's get started. This is the Sensational Select Goddess Remy Hair. It is a 14 inch color 1B, and I purchased two packs of this hair, but I only used about a pack and three fourths of the hair. Um, for my braiding pattern, it's it's braids going down this, going down, and then sewed up to right here. And I have this leave out like right here, so around my my head. So like right here, I have the leave out, so you guys can see where it is. Um. I've had this hair in for four weeks and five days. Yes, I keep count. Um, I got it installed on a Saturday because I had to go to a Christmas party, a, a church Christmas party soon. So I, I definitely got that installed. Um, this hair, it holds in the curl for a limited amount of time, but after that, the curls get, they fall, they get loose, but then it's like. It becomes like wavy, like a little wavy like that. You guys can see, I don't know, can't do anything. But like after the curls, you could definitely straighten it out and it'll come right back to bone straight. Now I did wash the hair. Um, I washed the hair on the third week and, um, excuse me. And this is what I use to wash the hair. I use um, Organics Olive oil shampoo which was three dollars and 49 cents at my beauty supply and i also used the um the organics leave-in conditioner which was also three dollars and 49 cents at my local beauty supply and for my for my leave out i put this on my hair the hair mayonnaise and it helps with damaged hair and my hair is really really damaged it's heat damage so um my hair is a color number two but then when I put in the sew in my hair could did not blend in so to make it blend in this is what I use I bought this from my local beauty supply and this is the Claire Worrell it's somebody clear um the professional semi-permanent color so I just put that on my leave out so my hair could blend in and it does blend in um I did cut the hair to to do a little um layering I did it myself like two weeks ago a week ago and um when I did get my sew I have no leave out in the bag so no I am trying to go natural so I'm trying to have like the least amount of hair out as possible because I'm trying to not just like to go natural and just stay natural but like I'm trying to like have healthy hair again like healthy thick full hair again sorry about this um um my the person who did my hair they they measured and cut measured and cut measured and cut so i don't know if that's like one of the main reason why this hair sheds but this hair sheds like ridiculous um it and it tangles ridiculously which is like one of the problems that i do have with it but this is what just came out of my hair as you guys can see I don't know if you can see all of this, but this is what just came out of my hair. All of this, about like five strands, more than five strands, that just came out of my hair. Um, but yeah, um, only on this side. It tangles a lot in the back, like in the back right here. It tangles a lot. Oh, and also it is true to length, um, the hair, 14 inches, so it's like below my boobs kind of and for the back it's like below my bra strap like almost down to my my lower back my lower back but i am five feet tall so it might differ for everybody else who's taller or shorter than me um so yeah the hair is nice it blends well it's true to length but the only problems that i have is that it it sheds like ridiculously like it sheds really like way too much like way too much like i had Milky Way Kosciaki, this hair shed more than Milky Way Kosciaki, and Milky Way Kosciaki was like $20 cheaper, like I don't know why this hair is shedding so ridiculously, but I did something kind of, you know, irresponsible of me, I cut something back here, like, 
late at night one time and I was like I don't know what it is but after I cut it oh my gosh like hair would just not stop coming out I was hair was like shedding and shedding and shedding and I was like oh my gosh is that humanly possible for this hair to shed so much and yeah this hair shed ridiculous but after I washed my hair um and use all that um this is the amount of hair that came out from one side and this is this side so I'm gonna separate it and have to show you guys this is the amount of hair that came out from this side right here this is the amount of hair that came out all this I had to make sure literally like to save it for you guys but yeah look it became a little circle but you can do this as a hair tie look all this hair you can make a track right now with it you can make your own track you know what I'm saying um yeah she did cut the wefts she always does but this time like I don't know what happened but this time this hair was shedding like ridiculously and it tangles but besides the shedding and the tangling that was my only problem um I sleep sometimes just like this with my hair like this and I wake up with like puffs but then like I comb it out and give it a good flat iron by using this heat protectant that I got from Garnier Fruit Teas and it smells so good after I use that it's like right back to normal like this because last night my hair was like all up in a rumble but yeah the only thing I have is the tangling and the shedding which is like at least like slow down just a little bit because not even it's the shedding is this much can it, I need to slow it down to this much like because there's too much shedding it's unacceptable to have all that shedding but yeah the hair is true to length um it is very nice and pretty um, in my opinion, I don't think I will buy the hair again just because of how much it sheds. But if I were to buy it again, I would um, not cut the webs and I would not cut anything about the hair except if I'm just trying to get layers in my hair. But that's the only thing I will cut. I'm not cutting nothing up here, just like right here. But um, yes, guys, this is the hair. I've had it in for four weeks and five days and I've been trying to find a review on them on this hair but I never find the one on this hair it's always the natural select or whatever it's like but this is the review that I'm giving you guys and you guys can comment down below if you want or you can rate comment and subscribe um but I am gonna take this out pretty soon probably in in the middle of February or even sooner it all depends on how this hair keeps on treating me um and then what I will be doing is um I will be putting in box braids and after I do my box braids for my birthday I will be I'm going to do box braids during February and then during March I will be making a U part wig to put on my hair on my head by myself I'm looking on YouTube and I'm learning day by day what I need to do and um if you guys have any good hair that you would recommend to do a U part wig that's like the price is reasonable like like store my beauty supply store hair let me know comment down below but that is all i have for you guys um if you want to buy this hair you should definitely do what you feel like is right like it flows it blends out I, I will show you guys i'll be doing a video showing you guys how it turns out with flexi rods which is not bad which is what i also use when i don't want to use heat on my hair i use these flexi rods they're like this long it's the long one. I got it at my local beauty supply store for two ninety nine a pack, and it comes in like it's six in a pack, so it's two ninety nine for six, which is not bad. And you could do whatever you want. You could do the the little spirals. You could do the waves. You could do whatever you want with these these little bad boys. But um, yes, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And you guys have you guys have a great great night. Bye.